Hello everyone and this is an unboxing of the Samsung LED Series 3 350 monitor 23 inch. This is for my new computer that I'll be getting and yeah this is, this is just it more or less. It was about £160 um, in American money, in American dollars I think that is about about $250 around, I think it's around that much not sure, should be around that so here it is some of these specs, there's full 1080p mega dynamic contrast ratio Samson magic angles which I'll explain to you if you don't know what that is energy saver down HDMI and stuff okay if you don't know what the Samson magic angles are <coughs> it's when you, I don't know, so you look at a screen from the left hand side and the colour seems slightly black-ish and yeah what this does it the colour's just like all nice and bright all the way around the monitor. Okay then I'm just gonna push this back that way a bit and sorry about that my camera just cut off for a minute and what I'm just gonna do now is just slice the sellotape here. I just need to just go to the other side one minute and just slice the sellotape. Okay then they use strong sellotape for this. So I cannot open it, there we are. So, I haven't really done unboxing before, so tell me what you think is good and bad about this. So, I would enjoy your feedback. So, okay. Just opening it up now. And here, this is what it would look like straight away. First, one of the first things you see is this. Um, energy saving thing. It's rated a B from G to A, so I think that's pretty good. Oh, okay then, you've got a little power cord. Okay, and little mini brick there, so not really too big. Um, here's the other end of the brick. Yeah. Um, wonder if they give you a free HDMI wire. Um, I think I I think this is it's in here is an American wire as well, and they give you a I'm not too sure what that is. In, I think it's a VGA and a VGA wire, or it might be DVI. I don't know. I'm not too sure on these wires like that. And there's like a Samsung's like guide in there, the setups, but we don't really need that. Put that to the side and. What's this here? Yeah, I've just picked out this. Uh, ah, okay, then I'm just gonna. Hello, I'm just holding the camera now, so I'm just gonna peel off the piece of plastic here. Oops, it is it. And that's the thing off there, the wrapper. Um, I might leave that on for a little bit. Okay, here's just some of the stuff that I said on the box. Um. I think it's got touchscreen buttons on it. And the first thing that I actually noticed when I looked at it, it's quite thin. So, yeah. It's, it doesn't look that thin on the video. Well, actually, it might look thin. I don't know. Depends what your class is thin. I think it seems quite thin. It's got a touch... I think they're touchscreen. I'm just going to power this on a minute. And... Yeah, be back when that's powered on and I'll set it up with a stand. Sorry about that, my camera cut off again and this was the bit that I just looked at here. This is what connects that bit at the bottom, the stand there. This is just part of the stand more or less. So here we are. I'm just going to put that to the side a minute. And now I'm just going to pull out this here. This is another bit of the stand. So I'm just going to put that to the side as well. Pull out this bit piece of cardboard here and here we actually have the main screen. I can get it out. Um, here we are. Uh, I'll flash this upside down. I'm not the best at unboxings. Um, sorry about that. My arm goes in the way of the screen. Uh, throw that to the side. Uh, here we actually have the screen. I'm just gonna. Move that to the side a minute. I'm just gonna pause the video and give you a better look around. 
So I've just set it all up now, and I'm using my PlayStation 3 on this for the moment because my computer that I'm going to use this on hasn't yet arrived. And yeah, so I'm well. So far, I'm pretty impressed with this. My nit well, this screen. I'll be doing a review on it in the future. Hopefully, when I get my um, when I get my computer, then I can use it like properly around and stuff. The um, the customizability on this thing is quite good as well. So what I mean by that is, right here at the bottom you have this button here, which lets you change different modes here. Samsung Magic Angles. This button here, and it changes like to different modes. I prefer standard mode. We just get off that in a minute. Okay then. And there we are, and here's just a bit of Modern Warfare 2 I'm showing on this at the moment. So far, from this, I would recommend, from what I've, my experience so far with it, I would recommend it. For the price, I think it's quite good for the price. So here it is, more or less, just rolling around on the PS3. Let's quick go in a quick match, and... Yeah, it's got nice, good quality on it, and yeah, I'd give this a thumbs up so far. And I'll do a review on it later on, and stay subscribed for that review. It should come in a few weeks, so thank you for watching.